the run on the banks has already started. And that's just from the calls that I get every day. People are telling me they're closing out the bank accounts, closing out IRAs, 401ks, paying the penalty, and they just, they, they're afraid of the collapse that's coming. That's, people are telling me that all day long, every day. I want to buy all 16 of these rounds because they are absolutely beautiful. Well, these are all the highest priced rounds that I have in the store. You know, they're, most of these are really expensive. Buy your precious metals online from SD Bullion. New customers get gold and silver at spot by visiting sdbullion.com slash new. This is what I want to be stacking, guys. Buffalo rounds. Isn't that beautiful? It is really busy in here, but I'm going to make sure I walk out with at least one of these tubes. I love one of these boxes. <laughs> All right, so here's the second one. Oh, it's a maple monster box. I'm a, an ultra MAGA Republican. I'm a super ultra MAGA Republican. And um, I really resent being insulted by this guy every time he opens his mouth. Uh, yeah. I hear you. I hear you. And, and mostly because I've been contributing to making America great for about the last 62 years. Ever since I was 15, I've been working every day. And uh, I, do, I don't appreciate the talk um, because MAGA means making America great again. And um, I know that that's not on this guy's agenda, but he doesn't have to go around insulting people every day. That's what he does. Yeah. And if anybody believes one word of that speech, they're in trouble. He can talk all he wants about taxing millionaires and billionaires. Uh, it never does happen. It never has happened. And right. the description of a congressman or a senator is millionaire or billionaire. Um, or at least they're, so are their uh, campaign contributors. So uh, I, I don't think they're going to raise taxes on themselves. I have a question. What's the question? No, I have money yeah, to you put spend. me on a soapbox. I have money to invest. I want to do, say, twenty grand on silver and gold, and I just want to know what my allowance should be, percentage-wise. Okay, that that actually is different for everybody. If you um, you have a chunk of money that you want to protect. Uh, that you don't think you'll ever have to spend, but you yeah. want to have it there in case you have an emergency, that's where you put the gold. Because uh, at any time you can always convert gold to silver or to cash. Uh, but I would say that you know, of the 20000 uh take a chunk that you just want to put in a safe place and, and turn that into gold. Uh, silver is, um, and you probably want enough silver to carry you through a difficult time uh, as a means of exchange, as barter. And that's, that's what mo pe most people are seeing, more barter every day, um, specifically silver, uh, around the country. And, um, I mean, it is growing by leaps and bounds. So you want to be able to have something you can use uh, for barter. And then the uh, the rest of it put in a safe place, and that's what you that's how you. You talked about online, you talk on uh, TV, being through uh, Yankee. You've already shows that the silver is hard to get in large quantities. Uh, do they drop ship or what? How do they do that? Uh, we've had more drop ships in the last two weeks than ever, and wow. uh, they do have minimums. I, I would think if 
it's at least 300 ounces in silver. It can be drop shipped. Um, something like 10 ounces of gold can be drop shipped. Uh, we do it every day. I did three last night. Um, there's a box sitting over here that has um, four kilo bars in it. And that's probably, I don't know, over 15 pounds. I don't want to send you know too much in those boxes because if they get dropped on a corner they might split open and, right. and we go through loads and loads of tape so if it's something i can drop ship we probably do that and the then the wholesaler takes care of the uh shipping cost and insurance tim what's the shipping expectations that that people like this gentleman should have well, it's uh, uh, Yankee's here, by the way, talking to me. So, uh, Hi. say hello to Yankee. How you doing? Good. Um, it depends on the item, and you know, I waited a little longer than I wanted to for the maple leaves that are on, in that box. Um, but you know, it's the the wholesalers are they're absolutely out straight. I mean, they're they're getting you know truckloads of product every day, but they're. Um, truckloads of people ordering stuff every day and you know it's i don't think that's going to change every now and then something might be hard to get and we'll extend the delivery you know a week or so yeah. um but it's you know, most things are available just because they're so aggressive at the wholesale level that and is drop ship faster uh well <laughs> I sent a drop ship out, and I was talking to the wholesaler, and I said, he's already gotten his shipment. What happened to mine? And he said, customers first. So, yeah, it's a little better for the customer than for me. Rule of thumb, though, when people call in and ask you for something, because of breaking up monster boxes and other types of items, should they have an expectation that this could take weeks? Before they receive their it, shipment. it has happened on on several items. Something like you know fractional gold is is a good example because you just don't order one fraction, one quarter ounce or one tenth ounce for a customer. Uh, you know, going to order a tube or you know ten or twenty or something, and, and that's that's where the problem is. Um, and the timing is everything. You know, if I have it in stock, I can quote a price, and if I have it in stock or on order, I can lock in the price um but i can't lock in the deliveries and there there are several things uh at work here we had a tracking number for an item um that was supposed to be in on wednesday i guess and um it arrived today um it was ups changed the delivery date and i mean they they you know how they operate i mean they have lots of trucks out there and lots of drivers and if they they load up a truck and um, it'll take uh, after five o'clock for them to get through the the route they may ship it the next day okay. and I think that everything's done by computer so the computer decides how much weight's going on the truck and how many items are going on the truck how long the route is um, and you know the guy we have here he's terrific but um, that's out of your control. Though. It's out of my control. If, right. the, if the computer changes the date, it right. changes the date. So be patient with Tim. If you're buying something from him and having it shipped, it could take a while. But he will make sure you get what you ask for. Yes, and all yeah, this I'd stuff. rather uh, I'd rather go to Tim than anybody else. I appreciate that. Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. You deserve it. I've seen quite a bit of volatility, aren't we, Tim? Uh, lately, yeah, because we had, what, two weeks when the metals were going up a little, down a little, up a little, down a little. And then you have the Federal Reserve that is still um, following the the Volcker procedure of trying to raise interest rates until they're higher than inflation. That's, uh, yeah. Trying to destroy jobs, too. That's what it does. Yeah. It just destroys jobs, makes everybody poor. Um, I mean, there are a lot of people out there who bought very expensive houses on adjustable rate mortgages, and they're they're getting killed. Let me see what the Maple Leafs are today. Every time Yankee comes in, or he tries to get me ranting. That's a good thing, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it keeps my heart going. <laughs> <laughs> That's therapy. <laughs> I'll have to check with my doctor about that. Speech, so we we're dumbfounded. Uh, it's it's shocking. 
Uh, and he continued. It's really shocking, Tim. Are you really shocked anymore by this? Exactly. <laughs> I am shocked that he continues to insult me. <laughs> you should not be shocked anymore. All righty. I'll uh, give you a holler when I email it out. Very good. Thank you very much. All right. Take care. Bye bye. I'm gonna get you riled up again, Tim. But first, look at look at all this silver and gold in in front of you. Are you uh, trying to help somebody uh, sell this to you? I think so. Eight bars, right? Yes, eight ten ounce bars. A bunch of ones. Wait, that didn't work, right? Would you buy them back? I'm in a better spot financially. I'd love to. Yeah. And would you go bars like this, or would you do something yeah. different? Yeah, you like them? Hopefully you have these same ones. <laughs> <laughs> I, doubt it, but I doubt it, yeah. Okay, should I get this guy some money before the phone rings again? You, you need to turn the ringer off for, for five minutes. I can't do that. You can for five I minutes. I cannot do that. 2180. That's a dollar thirty over. And uh, the novelty ones are eighty two. I get four of those wherever they went here. Um, ten ounce bars are uh seventeen twenty. That's another that's a dollar over melt times wow. uh times ten. Over melt? Nice. Everything's over melt. Everything that we buy is over. That's why I come here. Tim treats me good. So let me add that up for you. And I, you know, you while yours. you're filling out the paper, usually I say, is anybody here to buy something? And people always say, yeah, I want to buy those 10-ounce bars and the 1-ounce bars. I can't do that. I've got to do my paperwork on it before I sell it. Mm -hmm. over. Amazing. Almost got it right guys, guys, guys. So this one's really cool. The Silver Shield, Den of Thieves, Not Federal, No Reserves. <laughs> <laughs> this uh, Chris Dwayne was the one who came out with that. Came out with with these one ounce. You like these a lot? Yeah, yeah. I like that brand in particular. <laughs> wow. This place is packed today, but check out these silver rounds Tim just dropped on the counter. Okay. And then let's do the rest. And uh, what did you get these? Uh, Close again on the uh, Canadian maple leaves. Hello. Mm -hmm. Man. Wow. Okay. Nice. Well, yeah, I gotta pick some of these up. These are great. I do want to buy a tube of buffaloes, silver buffaloes, and I want to buy all 16 of these rounds because they are absolutely beautiful. Well, these are all the highest priced rounds that I have in the store you know they're most of these are really expensive um yeah they're, 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 they're yeah. really expensive ones 50 60 dollars a piece i assume right? i like the uh i like the zombie barber coin with the the uh scissors in his eye yeah don't and, you love that yeah. i thought of you as soon as i bought that one <laughs> you got you got plenty of uh of uh, buffalo tubes down here too for people right well, not plenty, because there are going to be a lot that I'm sending out. Okay, but so but I just opened one up. So is that also available for people, or are a lot of those already uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, if you want to buy a tube, yeah. sure. I, I, do, I won't charge you more than, too much more than I charge other people. But. You were the one that mentioned earlier what was going on with the banking. Uh, oh, right yeah. Um, what was that, Silicon Valley Bank? Yes. Yes. You mentioned that while we were here. Um, yeah, I... 
Yankee didn't even know this was going on. He, he mentioned it last <laughs> night, I guess. Well, and, and he didn't a risk to our banking system the crisis that could come. Yeah, yeah. Especially with the Fed raising interest rates. They're going to break something, and I was concerned that it might be in the bank. And uh, now well, I have. have. Oh, well, thank you for uh, mentioning that. Uh, Absolutely. Did you look on the news? I, didn't see that, I mean, you were, not surprised that that you were here talking to Tim, and we all know how Tim gets. <laughs> what are you selling right now, actually? You I'm are, selling this Valcambi and this 4 nines. <laughs> Hundred ouncer. So uh, one of the first, one of the first uh, bits of silver I bought myself. I'll buy it back. I just, I just need, uh, I just need to go into cash a little bit, and then uh, yeah. it's, it's big. Wow. That what is, is that? Big. Five eighths thick. Yeah. I think that's the one I filled with rebar. Um. <laughs> no, no, but I filled it with lead. <laughs> <laughs> well, again, thank you for uh, for mentioning that. Absolutely, I I, f I know you uh, you do a bunch of things in the financial sector. We've we've spoken before, so I figured uh, if you weren't you you hadn't posted about it yet, and if if you weren't aware of it, you probably ought to be. Yes, thank you very much. Are you gonna? Are you it's gonna? Good. It didn't recognize the rebar or the lid. Uh, what's the best, best way to go if I'm if I'm looking to uh, stack and and uh, if I can use it uh, later on uh, in need uh, uh, in case of uh, uh, need to do some bartering? Yeah, the um, the one ounce buffalo round is probably the best bet for that. Um, we sell tons and tons of those because they they come in a tube uh, of twenty. And they are, um, they're all pure silver. Um, you know, you don't have to do any math to uh, use them for barter because uh, that's what the, the basis for barter will be probably the one ounce coin. And it's changing so fast every day. I mean, you have today, the, 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 the banks are collapsing. Uh, everything, everything you guys have been said, you guys have been just basically uh, uh, profits. Silver profits, yeah, man. You can see it. Uh, sound money profits. And uh, appreciate you guys. Right. Have a good Thanks. one. Bye-bye. So what do you owe me, Tim? Oh, uh, gosh. I'm gonna, everything's at half price today. <laughs> <laughs> really? These rounds are half price? Oh, uh, oh. <laughs> well, not those. <laughs> okay, so if everything's half price, I'll take these back, no, and no, I'll take no. some of these. <laughs> yeah. I want to get Tim's take on it. Just how oh, absolutely! How bad this our, is going to be. Oh, well, how fragile our banking institution was. I mean, well, I've already said my opinion is that the run on the banks has already started, and hmm. that's just from the calls that I get every day. People are telling me they're closing out the bank accounts, closing out IRAs, 401ks, paying the penalty, and they just they're afraid of the collapse that's coming. People are telling me that all day long, every day. So, Thank you. Candy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, where'd that Valcambi go? Are you trying to hide it on me? Yeah, yeah where's that cool? Oh, 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 that's where it went. <laughs> Slick Timmy. That's his, uh, that's his nickname. <laughs> Pleasure hey, seeing you again, Yankee. Really appreciate it. Take no, care. absolutely. All right, I want to buy ah, this. I'll try right. these right. tubes and these 16 rounds. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> Boy, those are really top-notch oh. rounds. Yeah. Well, you're taking the zombie Mercury dimes here. I mean, it's yeah. like currency yeah. of the apocalypse. I'm not sure that was in the Bible. I, I'm going to have to check that. <laughs> currency of the apocalypse? No, yeah. no. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> you're getting a uh, yeah. eagle? I'm getting uh, an eagle, yeah. a maple leaf, uh -huh. and a buffalo. Actually, two maple leaves. Two gold maple leaves. Yeah. One gold American eagle. Yeah. And one gold buffalo. buffalo? Yep. Very nice. I get too much weight with the silver. Yeah. You reached a weight problem. I reached a weight problem. Yeah, weight problem. So for now sure. you're stacking dents. Yeah. Dents. Yeah, he told me before he had too, way too much weight in silver, so he, he joined uh, Nutrisystem, and it didn't didn't help a bit. I can't, I can't lose it. 
five years. Wow. It just doesn't want to fall over. <laughs> That's sweet. So keep the weight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Ease up on the yeah. silver diet, the right? <laughs> My wife likes me heavy anyway. Sharon's pretty stuff. Well, it's with my cake at the bedroom. So you're hoping to uh, add a one ounce gold pig to your. Oh, that would be nice. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, you get a shot at it. I know there's like 100,000 other people. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> it's more like 4,000. That's it, huh? We'll see. We'll see the final count. Okay. That's well, I hope it Thursday. goes to someone that can really use it. That's for sure. No, that's nice. We even stayed with my son in Hawaii for a couple months. I still, I still not watch it. I have to figure out how to do all. You're going to be able to fresh join in, in Thursday for a few minutes anyway. during my big right. epic <laughs> 100,000 <laughs> subscriber right. live stream. Why not? Yeah, call in, say hi to everybody. I'd love that. Right? <laughs> Buying some silver from Tim, and if you're interested in buying some silver from Tim too, check out the description below and uh, give him a ring. But please have some patience on the amount of time it takes for Tim to ship it out to you.